Welcome to the Canadian Guide to Mortgages. Many banks offer benefits known as prepayment privileges. Prepayments are extra payments you make to pay down your mortgage faster. These privileges are defined in the closed term mortgage contract you would sign with your bank. It sets out the amount of your mortgage debt that you are allowed to pay off without incurring a penalty. Typically, the amount of additional prepayments in any year ranges from 0 to 20%. Not all lenders or mortgage products offer prepayment privileges, so it's important to speak with your mortgage broker to compare your options prior to signing any mortgage contracts. There are two basic types of prepayments, monthly prepayments and annual prepayments. Let's assume a mortgage of $200,000 with an amortization of 30 years at an average rate of 7%. The minimum required monthly payment would be $1,317 and the total interest over the 30-year life of the mortgage would be $274,194. By simply electing to make an additional monthly prepayment of, say, $200, you would be mortgage-free in just over 21 years and your total interest over this period would reduce to just $175,420. This is a savings and in interest of almost $100,000. Similarly, you could elect to make an extra annual balloon payment against your mortgage. On the same mortgage of $200,000 over 30 years at an average annual rate of 7%, you could significantly reduce your interest costs by making a balloon payment each year. If you simply made an extra payment each year of $2,000, you would be mortgage-free in approximately 22 years. That's eight years sooner. And your total interest savings would be almost $85,000. For some homeowners, the best alternative is to combine both monthly and annual prepayment strategies. Let's consider that same $200,000 mortgage over 30 years at an average annual rate of 7%. If the homeowner were to make monthly extra prepayments of $200, and an annual lump sum payment of $2,000, the mortgage would be paid off in just 17 years, and the total interest saved would be almost $135,000. The homeowner has significantly reduced their total cost of homeownership and are in a position to focus entirely on retirement savings or moving up into a bigger home, or even buying a rental property or vacation home. <music>